What is going on guys and girls? It's Ghost Robo here on Ghost Robo Jr. on LEGO Dimensions launch day. A big, bold new crossover universe has been unleashed upon us. And I'm sitting here at this static screen because I've got a level pack for you today. By the title, by the thumbnail, you already know who it is, what it is. So let's drop Shell in and start our Portal 2 adventure. To unlock the Companion Cube and Sentry Turret, play through the Portal 2 level. So I've got all these other LEGO pieces in front of me and it looks like we'll get to build them and mess with them uh, when we beat her level. But here she is, ready to fire her portals of pleasure and awesomeness all over this LEGO world. And she has her own special level. That's what's awesome about the level packs, is you get a separate level of fun to play through. And we're going to do it today. If you guys enjoy this and want to see more level packs, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Let me know in the comments what characters and what worlds you want to see next here in LEGO Dimensions. Is it The Simpsons? Is it Scooby-Doo? Is it Jurassic World? Is it Back to the Future? Is it more LEGO Movie Ninjago? Let me know and I will do my best to bring it to you. Right now though, we're gonna stand here. Is that Portal World? Is that where you're taking me? Into GLaDOS's domain? Aperture Science? Let's do this, baby. I am so pumped. I love Portal 2. I love Portal 1. I love the whole universe and I think this is gonna be a heck of a lot of fun. I'm crazy excited that we get to merge Lego with Portal. And here it is. Wheatley! This morning, if I'm not mistaken. You test my patience. Well, as I don't really know how I got back here, what we should do is crack on with these tests and try and retake over the phys I mean escape. By that, what I mean is escape. Just yeah, just escape. Let's get going. Looks like the portal gun is so heavy for Chell, but she can do it. And Wheelie's here too. The voice actors are right. And this is ripe to be a brand new portal plot line, which is super exciting as someone who's a huge fan of those games. 89 is where we're at. The clock is already ticking. All the elements of Portal are here. It's so cool. Breaking stuff. Grabbing my Lego bits. So with the portals, I mean, we can't fire them on these services, but we will be able to fire and travel through portals, which is so awesome. So as you'll see here, this is something for Shell to do. Finally, we hit one of these cubes and we can actually do it. Hold down, square over white panel, then release to make a blue portal. Or circle to make an orange portal. When both portals, you can walk through them. Okay, sweet. So... Blue. Whoa. And orange, look at that. You can even break the freaking siding with this portal gun. It fires off more oomph than a bazooka. Seriously, it vibrates the entire controller. Oh, that's really cool. What is that? Is that a little robot guy? I feel bad, did we hurt him? We can break the cameras? <laughs> Everything, even the clock? It's all destructible. Here in the wonderful world of LEGO. Alright, let's actually go through this portal. Look, you can see Chell up there. So epic. Our first portal experiment is a success. Can I shoot Wheatley? I don't think I can. But I can shoot all this other stuff and grab lots of little LEGO chiclets. Alright. Stand here? No? What does this say? Pick up the companion cube with circle and then place them down on cube switches. Wait, where is the companion cube? I don't even see it. This thing? Wait, pick up the companion cube with circle and then place them down on cube switches. Do I have to build the companion cube? What does this mean? Oh, <gasps> start the build of the companion cube. Yes, we get to do this. Okay, awesome, how many? Oh, there's a lot of pages. I'm going to show this to you in real life. I'm, we're going to jump to a speed build of the companion cube. Are you guys ready for this? Speed build of my beloved little cubie cube begins right now. Thank you. 
companion cube created. That was a lot of fun. I actually really, really... I didn't know that I would like so much the fact that you get to build this stuff in real life and then add it to the game. So we're going to touch that companion cube that you just saw be built onto the gateway. And now put it on the central portal pad to tag it and write in its DNA. And now we've got it here to play within the real game, which I think is just so dang awesome. Such a cool concept. Only possible with Lego. So dang cool. I've got the companion cube with its little heart. Did you see that in the build? How it's got like a little heart there? I think that's so adorable. And yes. open sesame. <laughs> we really are quite the formidable team. I got the brains and the beauty, and uh, and you're also involved. Ever, ever so classy, Wheatley, aren't you? On to the next one, baby. Elevator and all. This really is portal, huh? Did I mention I'm still getting around to cleaning the facility up after Captain Moron nearly blew it up with his stupidity? So, um, still a bit bitter about that, are we? I think she is, Wheeling. I'd watch out for her if I were you. I love how they reference the whole space thing at the end of Portal 2 with his, like, uh, anti-grav talk. Let's grab a save point here in Aperture Science. Um, I'm gonna guess that we should carry the companion cube with us here. So as we walk up this way, what do we have going on here? X marks the spot, or maybe now there's a big cube there. What is the space for Chella standing? What? Back to building something new? I get to build the turret now? Okay, this is just getting way too cool. All right, guys, we're gonna warp back into the real reality in three, two, one. We're back, and yet again, another super fun build. The music in this game, especially in this portal pack, is really awesome. It's all like techy and synthy and futuristic. But it's time to write another tag. So we will take Mr. Turret, who looks absolutely incredible in Lego form, and write him in the central portal. And there he is in game form. Hey, buddy, don't be mean. I'm gonna have to squeeze out your spleen if you are. Oh, wow. That turret means business. Indeed he does. Look at this guy going to town like a crazy person. Alright, so might as well break this stuff up here. Get some extra Lego bits. Try not to fall off. Oh, this brings back such cool good memories. Okay, I'm going to bring the companion cube with me just in case I need it. Ooh, do you see that? There's a purple right there. How do I get that? How do you think I get that? Oh, it raises up. Sweet. All right, so I'm going to have to leave the portal or the companion cube there. All right, that's there. And then... But it looks like I have to shoot something. And that's not turned on. Huh. What do you think I need to bring through there? The companion cube, maybe? Oh no, I bet I have to go through here. Okay. Interesting. So you can knock that, blast that stuff up, but still make your portal appear. These are really challenging portal, like, puzzle that rooms. thermal discouragement beam is not part of this test. Please disregard it. I'm sure. Press that button. Then we get to send the little electric boogaloo bubble. Hit that switch. There we go. What does she mean it's not part of this test? It appears that your ability to solve simple tasks has not deteriorated. No. You must be very proud of yourself. 
I love the challenge here. This has got to be like one of the most challenging bits of a LEGO game ever. Upgrade companion cube to that to redirect lasers. Oh, eventually we get to upgrade the companion cube? I didn't even know that would be possible, but I guess we'll have to come back and play, replay this at a different day. For now, though, let's finish the level and drop down through Shell completes number 92, as in also, since we did 89, and we're moving right along. Oh. 91. Wheatley, will it be fun? I'm a little worried, this turret here. So look, he looks really menacing. For a guy I consciously built and put into this world, I brought you to life, I birthed you, companion cube. I'm gonna grab a save just in case something goes terribly wrong, but I think we'll be okay. All right, so crush the camera. Don't look at me. This is not selfie time. All right, the companion cube. Can I carry the turret? Oh, I can. Oh, look at Shell. She's carrying the turret. How adorable. It's so heavy, Wheatley. Oh my, look at that. All of these turrets. So many, so many. I don't want to push him off the edge. Um, turret buddy, I need to shoot a portal over here. There we go. Don't. Okay, I gotta walk this line very carefully. What is this? Place the turret by pressing circle near turret switches to cause to shoot at them automatically. Turret switches must be fired at. Kept keep active. Okay. Three blue bits over here. Hit this little radio man, who kind of reminds me of Brave Little Toaster, so I feel really guilty uh, squishing him with my portal goo. Alright, so clearly I have to carry the turret man through the portal here. Companion cube, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to chill for a little bit. I gotta bring this big boy, my Bronco. Whoa, whoa! Somehow I've just vortexed straight through the surface. Or the turret did. Hey, turret man, you and me, we gotta come together. We're a pair. We're a couple. Will you dance with me, Turret? Yes, Chell. Well, thank you. Whoop. Okay. That's a good thing, I guess. It looks like we made another uh, spot for a blue portal there. Break this apart. And then we can just go straight through the orange. And bring it to the blue. Now, I don't think I have to carry the companion cube with me all the time. Because since I can pick it up from the gateway and bring it back down, I can get it whenever I need to. Press X to jump into the excursion funnels and ride the current. Oh, sweet. I wonder if they're going to have gels in this, too. Not shells, but gels. Okay. Let's drop in the companion cube. Thank you, Silicon Bond Gun. Such a cutie. Such a cutie. <laughs> all right. Drop in. Jump up. There we go. Aperture science cannot be held responsible for anything occurring as a result of leaping aimlessly into excursion funnels. This is so These cool. include, but are not limited to, missing limbs, unconsciousness, and in some extreme situations, thinking you can escape the testing facility. <laughs> Whoa! Did not mean to do that. It mounts me back. Lickety splat, just like in Portal. I love how she's like, oh, oh, oh. Doing a little, like, tiny dance as we can see much more of the facility. Super nifty. Super nifty, Chell. Alright, don't hit that thing. Alright, more portals and a big door. Including a platform. For me, for more. Oh, what's this? Is that for an upgraded companion cube? What's this? Oh. Gandalf? I can bring Gandalf in. Check this out. Gandalf. I am Gandalf the Grey. <laughs> hey, buddy. Look at that. Okay, got to bring him to the light. This is wizard's work. Oh. And there's purples back here, which I love. And there's also something else. Oh. This doesn't have any evil inscription. A Wheatley mini kit. Oh, and another purple that gives us 10k. All right. Thanks, Gandalf, for helping out today. I'm going to take him off so he doesn't bother shelling her adventure. Why, you fools? We don't have the right thing for that? No, no, no. What does this say? Only characters such as Wonder Woman can deflect beams. Oh, wow. So you can even bring in extra characters to these levels for more fun. That's quite interesting. 
All right, so what's up here? Companion Cuber. All right, sweet. Okay, drop in Companion Cube. Come to me, I'm my favorite cube. I'll take care of you for all eternity. Sing, baby, sing. Grab a little thing and carry it to test chamber 92. Bingo, we beat it.